Hi everyone, this is Dr. Pasnati Suman, consultant pediatrician. In this video, I will be discussing about the most important vaccine that every child should and must get, that is pneumococcal vaccine. Now, we will see what are the diseases caused by this pneumococcus. This bacteria causes serious and even life-threatening infections which include infection of the tissues covering the brain and spinal cord called as pneumococcal meningitis and also the lung infection called as pneumonia. While lung infection is a serious condition, the brain infection can cause lifelong disability or even death in some children. And this bacteria is also a common cause of ear infections in children. This disease spreads when an infected person coughs or sneezes. Some children may carry the bacteria in their nose and throats and spread this disease without suffering from the disease. Children younger than 5 years and the elderly above 65 years are among the most risk for this disease. And children with weak immune systems are also at the highest risk of this infection and complications. India has a very high burden of pneumococcal diseases and this is the reason government has launched this vaccine in national immunization schedule in 2017 and is giving it for free now. Now we'll look at the symptoms of this disease. The symptoms depend on the part of the body it affects. If it's a lung infection, the child may present with fever with chills, cough, rapid breathing or difficulty breathing and also chest pain. If it's the infection of the brain and spinal cord, child may have severe high grade fever, headache, stiff neck, vomiting and also sometimes throw convulsions or fits. If the infection is only limited to blood, then the child may present with high fever and chills. Now, we will see what are the different types of pneumococcal vaccines available in India. At present, there are four types of vaccines available. The first one is Prevenar 13. This contains 13 varieties of the pneumococcus bacteria. The second one is Synflorix. This contains 10 varieties of the pneumococcus. The third one is Pneumocil. It contains 10 varieties of the pneumococcus, but two are different from those present in Synflorix. The fourth one is pneumococcal polysaccharide vaccine. This contains 23 types of the pneumococcus bacteria. The fourth one is pneumococcal polysaccharide vaccine. This contains 23 types of the pneumococcus bacteria. For children below the age of 6 months, 3 doses should be given. That is, at 6 weeks, 10 weeks and 14 weeks of life and also a booster dose at 12 to 15 months of age. Routine use of these vaccines above the age of 5 years is usually not recommended. Children more than 5 years of age with conditions that render them at high risk for pneumococcal diseases may need this vaccine beyond 5 years of age. The polysaccharide vaccine PPSV23 is recommended for all the adults of 65 years or older and any children of 2 years above or older with certain medical conditions that can lead to an increased risk for pneumococcal disease. And this vaccine cannot be used in children below 2 years of age. Coming to the safety of the vaccine, these vaccines are safe and when side effects do occur, they are usually mild and transient. These may include redness and swelling at the shot was given and fever, rarely fuzziness, sleepiness and loss of appetite may be seen. Coming to the question of who should receive this vaccine, all infants and children till 5 years of age should compulsorily receive this vaccine. Now we will see who should not receive this vaccine. Those who had severe allergic reaction after a previous dose of PCV or to any vaccine containing diphtheria toxide or has any severe life-threatening allergies to the vaccine components. Remember, this vaccine does not prevent all pneumococcal disease. It prevents the disease caused only by pneumococcal bacterial types present in the vaccine. These vaccines protect against more than 70% of the disease causing pneumococci in India. Now, after knowing about the importance of this pneumococcal vaccination, as a parent, you might be thinking that whether there is a vaccine available for your age group too. The answer is yes. The PCV13 or Prevenor vaccine is licensed for use for those above 50 years of age. 
and the schedule is to administer this vaccine first followed by PPSV 23 6 to 12 months later. This is all about the pneumococcal vaccine and I hope as a parent you will never miss this vaccination for your child. And thanks for watching. If you have any further queries, please do ask us in the comment section.